We'll hold hands. Got plenty of food. Get all kinds of goodies for you. Fair. Fair. All right, finally some pants. I'm not really dying for cloth right now, so I'm gonna bust them out. Get that last 5% healed. The jeans will give me a small amount more inventory space. I will shred that t-shirt though. It's a little bit embarrassing to run around the waist with the uh, no pants. Yo, man, if you get the better compass, it automatically upgrades your compass, even if you have the improvised one in your inventory. So many nice little things like that in H1Z1. It's like they took their time and thought about stuff or something. Weird. Why can't I, like, be breaking into the houses of, like, extremely conservative gun owners? Yeah. Then I find all the kinds of goodies. Instead, I fucking break into people's houses who were doing laundry when the apocalypse hit. <laughs> Muffin says it's surprising there's so few guns if it's based off of rural Texas. Good point. Good point. I agree. Texans are some fine gun owning folk. Definitely worse places to be in the apocalypse than Texas, you know? Marathian says, the kooks all bury them and since there's no shovel, you're out of luck. But there is a shovel. That would be cool if there was buried treasure. Well, that was a deer running by. I saw it through the window and I was like, what the fuck? Uh, the empty syringes are cool because you can fill them with zombie blood. I'm not sure if you can inject other players, but you must be able to.
Yam yeah, says, yo, if you see a store with a trash can fire outside, that's where I'm chilling, yo. I think I know exactly where you are, bro. Let me uh, head over there, too. Hello? Yams, my boy. Are you within? Hello? Yammy. Maybe you're not at this store. Perhaps there is no yam, sir. <laughs> Muffin says he has a posse in the woods waiting for you. Could be. Could be a different store, though. <laughs> yeah, so I guess trash can fires are a popular decoration in the post-apocalypse. Truth. <laughs> Easy killer. All that for a scrap of cloth. Thanks, bud. a quick look around I'm not sure what other store you might be near this area but I'm not super familiar with the map yet so who knows the only thing I really need to loot up right now is like weaponry if I can find yam I'll hook him up with some stuff I got a lot of extra Just to ensure it is the same server since Muffins ask, I play, uh, I'm playing on Romero. I'm gonna head down to the river and then go from there. Gam yeah, should do the same thing. Did I just find someone's vehicle parked out here by the river? Oh, they took their shit out of it. Look at my bowstring, it's bugged. It's haunted. Ah! The haunted bowstring. <laughs> that was scary. Alright, this car is, um. It needs things. 
There's another one. The fuck is going on? This one has is missing everything. Well, Yam can see where I'm at on stream, so it shouldn't be too tough to find me. I can't believe there's two jeeps parked here. Neither of them uh, have all the materials you need, though, but one of them's kind of close. I kind of want to blow them up, though. I wonder if someone duped the, the jeep. That's why there's two. Because the other one has nothing in it, so I bet it, it seems like it could be a dupe. Hacking. Sometimes there's 45s over here by these little camp chairs. <laughs> Left eye socket. Quality. <laughs> Betty. Luck out on the pistol this time. Marathian says, do zombies ever have guns? Very, very rarely. Uh, there's a system for players rising from the dead. And so sometimes you'll get one of those and they'll have all the loot that the player had. Yo, I bet I can find some fertilizer in this house up on this hill and make some smoke flares real quick. That'd be hype. Smoke flares are too fun. You may flee, dear. I have plenty of food. You're safe for now. And we got a lot of pipes. Like some waters. Some empty bottles. Down. Can I not have both? Give me that. There we go. It's open real quick. Right, that huge box just had cloth in it. Excellent. Definitely got some fertilizer going on. So I'm gonna real quick make a smoke flare. Cause they're so cool. What's awesome is when you hunt meat, you can salt the meat and make jerky and it's like even better. So many intricate little things in H1Z1. Probably one of my favorite things about the game. Yeah, Baratheon has it right, seek the smoke. Uh, what I'll do, Yam, is uh, I'll put a smoke flare down on the river and you should be able to just come to the smoke flare. Feel me? Come towards the smoke flare and we'll be able to meet up. 
I was hoping I get more than one smoke flare out of this run, but ah uh ha -huh. ha! Ask and ye shall receive. All right, two smoke flares. Cool, cause I want to have some left over to do traps and stuff with. All right, lovely. Decent little run. All right, my friend Yam. I hit you with a. A smoke flare. I'm gonna put it actually up here so that uh, you have an easier time finding where I'm at, but it is near the river. Yo, that rock just bugged out and did so much damage to me. Did you see it? Maybe those are some of the bugs people were crying about. I mean, I'm not really tripping about it. Shit like that happens in betas, but, or alphas, whatever this is. But that is kind of a bummer. I took that much damage just for touching a rock funny. <laughs> The rock did not appreciate it. Right, make some band-aids real fast. Just so I can be healing that off. This is actually cool. There's like a use for smoke grenades because you can use them to have your buddy find you. My bad, smoke flares. So you just ignite and then place where you want to. Bada boom. And now, like, that's pretty visible, so... Hopefully Yam will be able to see that big pillar there. But come to that. It doesn't pop out from very far away. Unlike the fires, that thing, I think, will be visible at maximum render distance. Yeah, you can see that forever. So just come to that, Yam. You should be good there. Meantime, I'm gonna try to fucking nature boy this deer. You see it sail over its head? I got it in the head! Oh my god, I just headshotted a deer with a bow. You have to be kidding me. There's no way I'm that good with the bow that I just headshot a deer with the bow. Oh, you're right. I didn't. He just ran away. It looked like I headshotted him. Ooh, I got him. I could have sworn I killed that other deer. But it's dark and I can't really see if he like died in the bush. I think this is the one. I'm gonna stalk my prey here. This is some good meat. I've got one on him. If I get another, we're good. Don't. Don't hide in a bush. You can still see that flare. Nice. Yo, Lan uh, Yam, let me know in chat if uh, you can see that flare. Should be able to. I'm fucked, I lost the deer. Smoke flares look so cool. Fill the quiver a little bit here. And smash a little bit of food. Chili with beans, one of my favorites. Love that MRE. Yam says, I can't see the smoke. You might be kind of far away then. Because I can see it from mad far.
All right, let me take a quick look through my backpack here. Got some ammo, old meds, antibiotics. A lot of bottles. Should extract some zombie blood. Eat a little more food here. Some delicious grats. Spicy chili. Take the multivitamins. They've got mats for a lot of stuff. Got a lot of water I could uh, fix up. A lot of empty bottles I could fill. I should probably make a dew collector, but the question is, where do I want to set up shop? Ah, he sees the smoke. Yo, Yam, come to the smoke, my dude. That shit lasts forever, too. Yam, come to the smoke. That bear, though. That bear, though. You do not... I'm surprised I haven't fought a wolf yet, but you do not want to play games with bears. Real talk. There's no way. He turned on his fucking speed hacks. Alright, yeah, I'm going to that smoke up there. I can see it. Then we'll meet up. I'll give you some stuff and you'll be such a happy boy. You don't even know. Bears are extremely... <gasps> I did headshot that deer! I did! I did headshot it! Look at this! Look at this. I headshot a deer with a bow. I'm gonna go back and highlight it then. I headshot a fucking deer with a bow. Who is the champion woodsman? B. Oh, and I got his bladder! Or her. Nah, it's a his. You don't want to kill the females. I hope they don't let you kill does in this game. That would be brutal. Yo, I got the deer bladder as well. And the animal fat can be turned into fuel for cars. Let's scope this shit out. You go over here to discovery. You go deer bladder and cloth. And you can make deer scent. About that shit. Now you can hunt deer more easily. I can't believe I got a headshot with the bow on a deer. It was such a hard shot, I was in disbelief. I was like, there's no way I actually did it. But I did it. You make biofuel from animal fat, but you gotta put it in a campfire. Fucking did it. Fucking did it. Yo, Yam, my dude, are you still headed toward the smoke right here? Are you, uh, you coming? My man? Yo, what's good? You found it, bro. You will not believe how much of Texas I've run across to find you. It's worth it though, right? Yes. Right, I'm gonna take you to my secret lair, okay? You wanna go? Sounds good. Let's go there, then I'll give you stuff. Yo, nice hat. Hey, thanks. I found it on, like, a toilet. Did you wipe it off at all, or? I mean, I didn't find it in the toilet. But, yes. Still germs, man. This is the apocalypse. You gotta love it. Yeah, I'm an elf. Yeah. Yo, what up, Count Butt? I'm sorry to hear that you're drunk and furious, but hopefully you'll be drunk and having a good time. Sorry, what? What is energy? Food. Are you low? I can give you some. Yo, I got salmon, chicken, some beets, some tomatoes. What are you feeling? Shit, man. I don't know. Uh, I you like chicken. bombs, pink salmon? I like, I like that too. All right, I just shit it out of my ass. Cool. 
enjoy that. Actually, probably need two foods. Let me shit out another can. Uh, there it is. But yeah, Count Bud, I'm sorry to he hear you're having a bad time, man, but hopefully this will help out. Yeah, man, I'm trying to keep it, you know, gluten free for you. If you're just dropping into the infinite couch, uh, tonight's stream is going to be a little shorter. Kind of uh, recovering from like a hip injury, so can't sit for too long at a time. Just chilling, playing some H1Z1 with uh, Yam here. It's Yam's first time playing, so uh, that's pretty hype. And he was able to find me due to some ingenious use of a smoke grenade. There's a wolf up here. Don't worry, I got you, baby. Thank you, sir. My hero. Watch out. Go. Wolf stakes tonight. All right. Cool. Yo, were you watching the stream when I went here before? No. Well, don't. It's not a murder lair or anything. Don't worry. Hey, it would be an honor to be murdered in lair by Davo. <laughs> Could you believe that I told that guy earlier I love you and you're a kind person and he stopped shooting me? He must have been out of ammo. Yeah! Uh, I hope you slide more. Yo, here's a hatchet if you want it. I'll hook it up for you in a second too. I got a bunch of stuff you can have. Crowbar and a hat in the bathroom, so I'll see. Thanks, man. I actually have one, but thank you. Alright, first let me drop some shit for you here. I'm gonna drop it right in front of you. Alright, take a couple of food items. Do you have a backpack? Now you do. I don't like beats. You can have these. You beats. Here's a compass too. You're spoiling me, Davo. I'm a nice guy. I don't think there's any use for the rest of the stuff I have. Take some bandages too. So the first thing I'm going to do is get a campfire going here. Uh, if you want to, smash up these boxes in this little area here. And in the back of the truck and see what you can find. I'll go chop down a tree. Yo, Count Butt says, I was having a great time drinking a few delicious home brews. I was aging for three years. Dude, nice. That's dedication. I love beer. What what uh, sort of homebrews were they? Ha, 
and Devin says my paycheck went through about 10 minutes ago, so I bought H1Z1. Yo, I'm happy to hear that, man. Hopefully you get in on uh, some H1Z1. I really enjoy it, man. Uh, for 20 bones to get in on it early, I think is worth. And I like to support things that I love with money, so I love hardcore survival games, so take my $20. <laughs> Yeah, looking forward to playing with you. Get a campfire going here. Down some salt. Yo, keep that shit, it's good. good Alright, I'm gonna cook up some uh, food and water in this campfire. Did you, do you have a bow? No, I do not. Alright, uh, did you see on stream how I showed how to discover recipes? Uh, no, but I've been messing around with it a little bit. Okay, yeah, it's, it's pretty easy to learn. Uh, the, the bow needs a cloth and a stick. Okay. Uh, stick. I don't have any cloth, but sticks are... Have you seen me loot them on stream? Do you know what they look like? Actually, sticks come from these little things right here. And, but you have to have empty hands. Oh, actually, you got it. And then uh, the other thing sticks come from, or see these little thin trees over here? They're like saplings, so you can get sticks from those too. So I'd set up a bow and arrow if I were you. <laughs> Alright, let's get this campfire started. Boom. And then to light the campfire, I use my flare up, but you can also use this bow drill. You actually put it in the campfire inventory and then hit ignite. And the reason it takes a long time is a bow drill is what you call the thing where you like rub wood together and make a fire. Yo, and Devin says, I love watching these games evolve over time from alpha through beta. Me too, man. I love it. Count Buffarchula says, one was an Imperial Russian Stout. And it had some white IPA from Coriander and Kumquat. Yo, that sounds good. And a little cardamom. Vividus Karma. Yo, man, what a great Twitch name. Thank you for following. That does get us just a little bit closer to Achievo number two. So thank you, man. I appreciate it. All right, so take a look at all these goods here. I can get going first. Uh, the first thing I want to do is put all my stagnant water in here. Uh, the bow drill is reusable, by the way. You can take it back. Um, that'll turn into purified water for me. The second thing I want to do is put all my salt in there. And then add, actually no, is that how you do it? Give me just a second, I might need to discover it. Let's do venison and salt. There we go, wolf meat. Oh, I don't think you can make wolf jerky. Rip. All right, so deer jerky, uh, you just put the salt and the venison into the fire. So I put my venison, my salt, that's gonna make deer jerky. I put my wolf meat in there, that's gonna make wolf steaks. Uh, this will burn into charcoal. Uh, let's see if there's anything else I need to cook in there. I don't think so. I think that'll get us there. Put my deer sand up here. Alright, we're looking good. Okay, we're living out on the range now. Uh, the other thing I'm going to do here momentarily is build a uh, dew collector so we can get some water. So I think I'm going to turn this into uh, like a little base up here. Because the uh, loot respawns, you know, so there's a lot of stuff you can harvest from here. And it's, as you can see, very remote. Yes. The one drawback is this ridge up behind it. People could easily get up on it. But the way I look at it is like if you were suspicious of people being here, you would just go up to on the ridge yourself and then wait for them to come down and try to steal your shit. 
you can also kind of glitch onto this canister if you sprint jump onto the dumpster or you can jump from the table yeah I think they fixed it where you have to go from the table sprint jump from the table and you'll make it I think that's easy to fuck up as you can see Ah, uh, they might have fixed it. I hope they didn't fix it. Let me try running. Like, I think I can get a couple steps of running on these pallets. Oop, hold on, hold on. We can do this. Alright, hold up. Try from back here. I remember this working. Ow! Ow! Alright, it took damage, but I think it's doable. Or they might have patched it. Hundred percent. This is a true hold my beer moment. Yeah, let me try this angle. It looks a little closer. Yeah. There we go. Now hit F6 to celebrate. Wait, they changed it. You see it? It's like weak now. He barely wiggles at all. Yo, the spirit is all gone of the F6. What have they done? I'm uninstalling. Nice plan for you, Dave. <laughs> Damn count butt, that sounds delicious. In my experience with homebrewing, IPAs are a little easier to uh, make than stouts though, so that's probably why it turned out how it did. Oh, uh, one of my deers, or my venison turned into steak instead of jerky, whatever. All right, I'm gonna take, I'll let him have the better food. I'll just take the wolf steak. Give him half of the waters. You don't have a water bottle, right? I think I did. But I may have dropped it to make room for the hat. Alright, let me give you one. Alright, go ahead and drink up that water, the purified. And then I'm actually going to use some of the rest to make some first aid kits. But we should be able to collect some more water with the next thing I craft. Alright, so to make some first aid kits again, you just first... Actually, it's going to do that thing for me where it knows I have the materials to make the saline. So it'll auto-craft it, watch. First it makes the saline, then it makes the first aid kit. By the way, this is Texas. Oh, dude. Hit it up with bullets, yeah. Oh, they fell right out of your ass. Well, yeah, I didn't have any more room in my, uh, striped t-shirt. Here, take that first aid kit, but don't use it unless you're, like, really low on health. Otherwise, use bandages. Okay. And if you look in the fire, there's some, uh, food for you, too. You can grab that charcoal if you want to. It's handy to have if you find a furnace, if you need to use it. But it's pretty easy to come by because you can just burn wood. Now let me enjoy some of my wolf steak from headshotting that wolf. Delicious. Uh, now the next thing is I have a bunch of empty bottles. Eight, actually, so it's time to make a dew collector. Damn, deer's good eating. Hell yeah, it is. Have you had a uh, venison in real life? Nah. It's so fucking good, bro. It's my favorite meat. Rayfin says, shouldn't you be making better backpacks? To make the frame backpack, we need twine, which is not craftable. So we could go on an excursion to try to find some twine. 
Um, but other than that, we can't make a backpack. Everything else is craftable, but you need twine. Oh, look, more. 308's my shit. If I find a hunting rifle, life's over for everyone. Snipo. Alright, I need to make a dew collector so we can get some water going. I found a tarp. Let's see. So, for the dew collector, I'm gonna need. I have my tarp already. Four wood planks and four wood sticks. So that actually means eight wood sticks and you can turn wood sticks into wood planks. Well, yo, if you have a tarp, all you need is eight wood sticks. Uh, turn four of them into planks. Let me check that. Actually, no, hang on. You need logs to get planks. But I tell you what. Go gather um, eight sticks and I'll gather the planks we need and then we'll come back and make two dew collectors, alright? Sounds good. Alright, so I'm gonna chop down a wood to get, uh, we need eight planks for two dew collectors and he's gonna get eight sticks and then we'll, I'll make the dew collector here and I'll let Yam hang on to his so he can take it with him and if he needs water he can set it down somewhere else. Because it only takes up I think 50 inventory, so. Alright, so wood log makes one planks. Oh, it actually makes two per. So how many do I have right now? So I've got half of them right now. Didn't I loot three logs? The more time you spend in an area in H1Z1, the more likely it is that Zeds will spawn. Uh, so that's kind of cool too. It's also related to the amount of noise you make. So like me and Yam are talking back and forth in direct, and that actually attracts zombies. You can like yell at a zombie, and you'll get its attention. It's so cool. Raven says, shouldn't you be making better backpacks? This has been your mission for days now. There's actually just a server wipe. Uh, so this is a fresh character that I started about three hours ago. I'm kind of starting all the way over. Wait, what? Oh, I accidentally crafted mine. Shit. <laughs> All good. I can make the planks for him. Uh, so he's gonna need four planks, and I've got just enough. I believe. All right. Yeah. All right, bro. I actually just went ahead and made mine, but here's the planks you need to make yours. And I'd keep yours in your backpack so you can use it later on. I'll stick this one down for now. Alright, so the second thing I'm going to build out here is a dew collector. Uh, the dew collector is pretty hype because it fills empty bottles with water over time. Quite large though. But I like putting it there. It's a little bit of cover. It's kind of nice. So you open the dew collector and you put in your empty bottles and you come back and check it and they might have stuff in them. Very fancy. Take a quick look at my inventory here. Oh, I can make some coffee. That'll be nice. That'll be nice. Alright pretty good 
<laughs> Raven says, damn them taking your progress. Nah, man, it's the alpha. It's all good. Yo, the boxes are already repopping. Nada. We'll shoot. Alright, so we should go on a run and then head back to see if we got some water in there. Feel me? Oh, I feel you. And it'd be awesome to find a gun. Let me uh, restock my quiver a little, then we'll roll out. Like a beautiful little band of merry elves. I don't want that crowbar. Get out of my inventory. I could just grab arrows on our way down the hill. Oh wait, hold up. Let me try that squad invite thing again. Cause your name's not green. Okay. Maybe you have to be close. Let me try. Let me get a little closer. Did you get an invite? Nope. Hold on one second. All right, types forward slash, or I'm sorry, enter forward slash squad space except. There you go. I, I done did it. Do I have a green name? Nah. My name's not green? Name, yellow name, that means I'm the squad leader, okay. Cool. All right, that's awesome. So you guys saw that, let me make some arrows real quick while I yell at the stream. Um, you guys saw that, so if you're trying to squad up in H1Z1, again, the developers have uh, not confirmed this will stay in. But if you type forward slash squad space invite space someone's name, and then they type forward slash squad space accept, it'll make their name green, and all squad members' names green, and uh, if you see the squad leader, it's yellow. This system is awesome because basically we can squad up everybody from the OSHA and anytime you encounter anybody from the stream and game, you'll know. Sounds pretty boss. That's fucking dope. Alright, let's roll. Alright. By the way, if you're trying to join up, we are playing on the Romero server. And I could do a slash location for y'all if need be. I think there might be some houses down here. I should make you take out some Zeds so you can get some bow practice. Here you go, here's one coming. Get him, yam! Got this, man. Maybe not. Got it. All right, that's your loot. You get it. You earned it. Oh, well, thank you. What is it? A couple of shotgun shells. I'll take those, actually. <laughs> Is 
This is because I got a huge backpack. Makes sense. I think but I if once or twice. If we, f yeah, you did. Uh, a nice thing is uh, if a Zed gets close to you, or actually a player too, you can hit Q and you'll shove them a little. Me and Guru tested that you can actually stun lock people if you have two people and you time it well. That sounds amazing. Oh, it makes people really upset when like you stun lock them and you just keep doing it and they can't even get away from you and you're just like... <laughs> you basically just shove them back and forth. Do you remember Night at the Roxbury on SNL? My head. Oh man, well anyone in the chat who remembers like two dudes who would like go up to girls at the club and then just bounce her back and forth between them. It's like that but with a, a man. Yo Yam, and Devin uh, on the infinite couch wants me to use a snare on you like a guinea pig. Sure. Alright, if we come across uh, materials I'll do it. For science only. Of course. Yo, yeah, take some take some practice shots at uh, Edward down there. I saved you. Don't worry. I owe you my life, Sensei. Technically, now I'm responsible for you. Yo, I see the arrow, and it lets it light up, but it won't give it to me. Alright, we got another you can try out right here. Use Q! Oh, you got him! Nice! I'm learning. Yeah, dude, that's kind of a strat too when you're getting good at the bow is like let him get kind of close. Hit him with Q. And then in that moment that they're staggered, you can get him. You see that deer down there? Stay back. I'm gonna put on my deer scent and bow hunt it. Cool. Alright, be very quiet. I'm hunting deer. Alright, let's see how much the deer scent affects how well the deer can uh, detect you. Just look directly at me. Does the deer scent not last very long? It looks like it already wore off. Alright, I can probably hit it from here. There's- what? Come on, give it to me. Alright, it's wounded. Gotta track it. Gotta track it. Yo, you circle it from the left. Get that wolf, we got some competition. Ugh. You got it, yeah! Great work. All right, let me harvest his body. So to get a uh, venison, you need an axe or a machete or something. Then you just hit the body. All right, I got two deer steaks and some animal fat. Nicely done. That was a good shot, man. Hey, thank you. All right, back up here. Yeah.
I think the dew collector takes like a good while. Makes sense. Yeah, definitely. I actually think a day and night cycle has to pass, which makes total sense. Yeah, gen generally dew only comes once a day. Yep, yep. Nerds don't know that. Alright, let's circle this uh, deer again. That worked well. He heard my plan. Like Alright, he's the deer uh, earned his life, it's cool. Get some more arrows here. Oh shit, wait. He wants more. Shit, did he just run through a tree for you? Yeah, he did. Alright, we don't wanna fuck with a spectral deer, yeah. I make some arrows real quick. I will take the opportunity to do the same. more Zed murder. That's a pretty good shot. Got a weapon repair kit. Nah. Alright, my bow's gonna break soon, so I, I gotta craft another one at some point. We should actually double back over here to the right because it's getting dark. So we can grab our dew collector hopefully in the morning. Okay. There's a little spot we could probably loot on the way back though. Yeah. Marathian thinks we should start a roving murder gang. Gam, what do you think of that? Yeah, we're trying to just chill out and enjoy some venison, you know? Grab some uh, blackberries, too. Because we can make juice. Sell it at the farmer's market, you know? Blackberries! <laughs> Good for the soul. Alright, Marathi and Clarified, it should be a deer murder gang. Put a lot of arrows in that guy. <laughs> yeah. So on the hardcore servers I play on, how it works is if you die, all the recipes you learn go away. Oh, that sounds like it sucks. 
That's not too bad. You just gotta remember him. And uh, zombies only die to headshots. Wow. And it's first person only. Golly, that sounds like super immersion. The way, the way to play. Be too immersed, you couldn't come back. True. From playing hardcore survival games, my life is ruined now. I regard all others with suspicion. Yeah, run, fucking deer. You win today. Go make lots of children we can kill later. When we get back to the little compound, I'm gonna take a break, but I'll probably play for a while more if you're down. Uh, I probably ought to go to bed soon. I got work in the morning. No, no worries. Now that was cool. The dual arrow. Well, the hype thing is with the squad setup, like, it's so easy to find people from the stream. Yeah. I hope they don't get rid of that. I don't know. Yeah, I hope they keep it in. Right now, they're, like, waffling on it because it's, like... I don't actually know what a drawback of it is. I don't know why you would take it out. Because it's, like... I think they might take names out. And so that's really what they're waffling on, is if you're going to be able to have names or not like this. But I think it's, even though it's like a layer of abstraction, it's like a very useful one, you know? Yeah. You gotta know who your friends are. Exactly. And I get a yellow name, so I mean... Yeah. Alright, we've got a little dirty water already, but we'll have more later. And then we gotta boil that water. Because rainwater in the apocalypse is nasty, apparently. JC says it's basically like a guild in an MMO. Yo, did, uh, I don't know if you're watching the stream right now, but JC just said, uh, compared it to a guild and an MMO. That's a really good way to uh, compare it. Yeah, except that it's actually useful. <laughs> True. Alright, Thug, well, I'm going to log out when I take a break. So if you're logging for now, man, it's been a pleasure. Likewise, sir. Looking forward to another... Hell yeah, man. There we go. We gotta hit that F6, even though it's subdued. Very subdued ass shake. It's, uh, it's tasteful. Yeah, it's, it's classier now. You know? Slow. Classy post-apocalyptic butt shake. Alright, man. We'll get some good rest. Hopefully see you around the Osho soon. You too, man. Without. Oh, man. A butt. That awkward logout eye contact. A butt guy. Eek. Actually, you know what? I think, honestly, in the interest, I'm probably that's probably gonna be it for the Osho. To be real with y'all, that way I can do a really long one tomorrow. I think we're gonna call it. That. That's the wise decision. They gotta make wise moves from time to time. So we are gonna go ahead and call that the O show. It's only it's like a half O show, it's like three hours. Not too long. Uh but like I said, I got kinda like a hip injury going on for my arthritis, so I gotta take care of that. But worry not. Uh the O show is gonna return tomorrow. Tomorrow's Osho is actually going to be a really long one. Uh, one of those overnight ones. 
until about 6 in the morning Pacific. As always, big ups to everybody who spent some time chilling on the Infinite Couch this evening. Yo, if you're new to the broadcast, first, thanks for the follows. Second, take a look at the info down below the video. It'll answer basically any question you could possibly have about the O Show. Bomber asks, what time tomorrow? Pretty late. I might start at like midnight, something like that. We'll see. But yeah, it was an awesome time as usual. Great time chilling with y'all. Great to play with you, Sir Gam. Catch you guys next time. Oh, my God.